guys this is Veda here and today I'm going to talk to you guys about the weather monitoring model so first I'll talk to you guys about what is the Arduino and Arduino is an open source platform used for building electronic projects like this one Arduino consists of both a physical programmable circuit board often referred to as a microcontroller and a piece of software or IDE that runs on your computer used to write and upload computer code to the physical board Next is a mail component, the ESP8266. The ESP8266 module is a self-contained SOC with integrated TCP IP protocol stack that can give any microcontroller access to your Wi-Fi network. The ESP8266 is capable of either hosting an application or offloading all Wi-Fi networking functions from another application processor. Each ESP8266 module comes pre-programmed with an 80 command set firmware meaning you can simply hook this up to your Arduino device and get about as much Wi-Fi ability as your Wi-Fi shield offers. Next, we'll talk about what is the DHT sensor, which will be heavily used in this project. The DHT sensors are made of two parts, a capacity humidity sensor and a thermistor. There is also a very basic chip inside that that does some analog to digital conversation and spits out the di digital signal with the temperature and humidity. The digital signal is fairly easy to use using any microcontroller like the Arduino. Now let's connect the D DHT sensor to the Arduino and the ESP8266. Hey guys, Veda here, and today I'll show you guys the weather project model using the Arduino, the code used to make it, and showing guys the result on the Arduino open source platform. So let's get into the video. First, I'll talk to you guys about what is a DHT sensor. DHT sensors are made of two parts, a capacity humidity sensor and a thermistor. There is also a very big chip inside that does some analog to digital conversation that spits out a digital signal. The signal is very easy to read using any microcontroller. So first, I'll show you guys the equipment. The equipment you need is an Arduino interface with the ESP8266. If you don't know how to do that, you can check out the SOL monitoring video. A bunch of 1 pin connectors and the DHT sensor. So you have to connect 3 1 pin connectors to the VCC pin the data pin and the ground pin so the v connect the VCC pin to the 5 volt pin of the Arduino connect the data pin to pin 2 of Arduino and the ground pin to the ground pin on the Arduino when you are done with the connections you can connect connect the Arduino to the PC using this wire and that's all for the connection. So at the start, you write variables like int A, temp, and humidity, means temperature and humidity. Then you initialize, then you initialize your Wi-Fi with writing your name of your Wi-Fi and password, so you can connect your Wi-Fi to the Arduino. The string send that method checks for the Wi-Fi using the ESP8266 Wi-Fi module. The setup method which runs only once initializes all the variables. It checks the connection loop method where you write the main code run repeatedly and every 2 seconds with the temperature and humidity gives a new value to the temperature and humidity variables and you use a serial print to show the temperature and humidity and a value next to it and that's mainly what the coding means now that we have written the coding we can check the result so first we check the serial monitor Okay, so first it checks the Wi-Fi. And 
and then it gives the temperature such as 25 degrees and humidity is 72 degrees the temperature keeps changing every 2 seconds or 2000 milliseconds and now that we have seen the values we can check it on the graph so here we can see the temperature going up and down and because the temperature changes every the temperature continuously changes here we can see the humidity and temperature and the amount of time and that's it guys in the next video that's it guys in the next video i'll talk to you guys about the virtual sensor overview which will have its own monitoring project so i'll see you guys in the next video mm -hmm.